Hello, what's going on everyone? This is Tim, and I haven't uploaded a video in like three weeks. It's insane. Um, I just haven't really had anything to do, but I finally did something that's pretty cool, and I wanted to share it with you guys. I've been working on it for a while since the snapshot started rolling out, so uh, here it is. It is Guitar Hero in Minecraft. That's right. Um, I had this idea, and I was like, is this really possible? And I played around with it some, and uh, it actually it is possible. I, I, I made it. Um, now it's a very um, simple version of it. I'd call it like an alpha version. I don't know if that's really the cor correct terminology or anything or anything, but uh, yeah, I made it. Um, it has one song and a very basic like scoring system, but I think it's pretty cool. I'm pretty proud of how it turned out. Uh, and if there's enough interest in it, I'll certainly keep working on it. Um, so yeah, let me show you guys how it works. Um, here we are. We need to get a record from over here. There we go, and then we need to put it in here, and let me turn up my, is it music, or is it master volume, oh no, no jukebox, that's, that's it full, alright, cool, so that should be good, and we're going to play this game, so the goal is to basically hit the pressure plates when that thing, when the falling sand, ooh, I messed that up, passes the white line, and I'm, I'm honestly not too good at my own game, um, it is kind of hard, like, if you get, if you get 100% on this, I will be very impressed. I don't even know if it's possible. But, <laughs> yeah, uh, it's a lot about timing, some of them are really hard to hit. Uh, my best is like 70-some percent, I think. Let's see if I can beat that this time, I don't know. Oh, shit. Sometimes you have to just look jumping. It's very difficult. <laughs> yeah, it's really hard. Sometimes you want to move a little early, and it makes you mistime it. So you like you step on the pressure plate too soon. Like there, I just did it. But oh, I think I got that one. Okay, it's not too long. It's like a 50-second song. This is the hardest one. Boom! I think I got that last one. That was pretty good. Alright, so now it's going to uh, calculate the score. <laughs> and I got. What did I get? 63%. Alright, that's like my average. I, I normally get like 60, 65 ish. Uh, it's very difficult. Um, press reset. Yeah, so you can uh, press reset, ignore the explosions. <laughs> and uh, then you're all, you're all good to start over again. You're going to want to take this out though. Um, which, yeah, it kind of just falls over there. Cause you gotta take a, the record out to start over, but yeah, that's my game. Um, I'm gonna link to it in the description, and I'm gonna show. I'm gonna upload a separate video um, for anyone interested in how it's made. I'll link to that in the description. Put an annotation on the screen right now. Um, I'm gonna record that right now after this, and upload them around the same time. So if you want to see how I did this, check that video out. Um, but yeah, you gotta. I, I have a Minecraft forum post about it. So if you want to download this map and try it for yourself, you need to download the map and uh, a resource pack that gives a new sound to this. Um, it's it's a it's called um oh shoot <laughs> it's a Kevin Mac MacLeod or Cloud song um, Stealth Groover that's what it's called yeah so that's the that's the tune that's playing so uh, yeah you need a snapshot 13w41 well. You need 41A or B if you want the stained glass to work, but if you want the game to work, it just needs to be, I think, 37 or later. I would recommend just getting the latest snapshot, though. So, yeah, that's my game. I hope you guys like it. hope you guys try it out. Let me know. Uh, any feedback would be awesome. I'd love to keep working on this if you guys want me to. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.